Hi guys. Today's November 7th. Um, I'm up pretty early. It's 7.45. I've been up since 7. In the mornings when I wake up, my phone reminds me to like pray and that stuff. Which is amazing. I'm about to go to the DMV today, so I'm trying to make sure that around my hair is like neat and cute. So, um, yeah, I'm trying to be productive before work. Work today is at 2 o'clock. But, I feel like, I feel like we know that shit at the DMV could take a minute. So, I really just want to get the day on and popping from early. Okay? So, I still have some time to play around. I have lunch because I cooked yesterday. Yesterday I made stew pork and white rice. Bomb as hell. So that's what I'm going to have for my lunch today. And then the rest is in the fridge. I'm gonna just swoop my edges a little bit. Um, because I washed my hair and did it last night and put it up in a ponytail last night. <clears throat> and then I went to the place with my friend. We stayed there for about like her interview with the people lasted about i don't think it even lasted 45 minutes maybe 40 minutes and she was out which is pretty dope i'm gonna like put some of my eco styler on the back and like tie it back tie it back down a little bit just to um get it laying nice and flat my puff is looking kind of healthy. Yesterday I saw a girl with a blue, I think it was on Instagram too, with a blue on the end of her hair. And I'm like, oh my gosh, this is the first time since I've colored my hair that I've ever felt like putting a color on there. Because initially when I did it, I just wanted it to stay in this um honey blonde type look type color that's just what i wanted it to have but now i've been feeling like a color won't hurt so um yeah the dmv opens at 8 30 right now 7 48 so i have a lot of time i have some mac and cheese that i made yesterday with dinner that i'm going to eat now for breakfast with some tea today i also want to i'm probably too ambitious right now and i'm pushing it too much i want to run to the dmv really quickly right get what i'm doing done and hopefully run to the grocery store real quick too to pick up some stuff before however if i don't get to do the grocery store before work i can do it later on maybe i should just do it later on when i leave work because I leave at 8 and then the grocery store is right beside my job. So I could do that later. And then um, just come home. That makes sense. So um, I might do that. Because at least I'm going to be right there. Anyways, y'all just saw what I did. So I'm going to go now, eat breakfast, and then come back and like shower and get today. So, I mean, I've already gotten the day started, but you know what I mean. I feel like I'm going to just get some practice now. You need to, yeah. Right. And then I'm going to go get my license and then I'm going to be popping. Yeah. Okay. Well, you know, you can drive with someone next to you. You know, at least they have a license. Well, yeah, there's that. <laughs> but I'm, I'm really happy that I actually passed because I've made a few trips to the DMV to get it done. And every time it was just something else. One time I forgot proof of address, something else. One day it was so full and I had to go to work. So I'm really glad that today I actually came and early. Wine, wine, wine. 
went through hell with that proof of address. Oh my gosh. We asked for every single That's what I'm saying thing. too. They were asking for just the most. So this morning, actually yesterday, I was like, you know what? Yesterday was my day off and I was gonna come yesterday and out of nowhere I just changed my mind and I'm like I go in today at two which gives me enough time in the morning to like go and get it done. I'm gonna wake up early. I woke up seven o'clock. Then I realized the place opens at like 8 30. I left home at 8 40 and I was like I'm gonna go get it done today today and it was just a breeze. Right, yeah, it went, it went back so quick. Yeah, because it was it wasn't full. It was really moving quickly. There was like two persons in front of me. Oh, and in no time I was done. Nice. So I was so happy to about go to that. Like a private school or you don't need to? I, I will. Oh, I will. Because okay. I want to. Yeah, I will. Yeah, yeah. Well, I think I will do a few classes in like, you know? Yeah, no, that's very that's really important actually. Uh, a friend of mine. Uh, I think that's the better thing to do. Yes. Go and learn professionally. He thought he, he can drive. He drives. But uh, he failed his test. Oh my gosh. That, that, well, that's what happened with being overconfident, you know. Yeah. Never be overconfident with those instructors. It's so crazy because last night, um, my friend had this thing to do in Manhattan, but she wanted me to go with her because you know how Manhattan is with like the parking. Yeah. So I had to sit in her car while she goes and like do her interview. And she was like, listen, just don't let them tow my car. If they come, just drive straight. And I'm like, oh my God, like this is not the Please, place where I want to yeah. mess around and drive. Please, and I was just in the that. car praying. Nobody came. But it's nighttime and it was kind of wet, so I kind of figured nobody would really come. Uh, don't listen to your friend in case like that when they come, just tell them to call my friend. Don't move the car. Because it was in like a no standing zone. Yeah, yeah, no, but... But the can... car was still on, so I'm like, I could tell them that, you know? Well, if it's on, technically you are uh, driving. Yeah. It's a moving violation. That's if what she... If the car is on and you are on this seat, you are required to have a license. Oh damn! <laughs> yeah, that's, that's. I wasn't in the seat though; I was in the passenger seat. Yeah, so okay, I said, okay. if somebody did come, I just tell them she's coming. You know. After you get your license, I will tell you a friend of mine told me at that time, and I didn't listen. You have a year probation. Do not do any stupid thing. <laughs> oh my god! Hi y'all. So I've been back from the DMV for like a good minute now, but. I passed my learner's permit test. I'm so excited because for weeks I've been going back and forth to a DMV. Some of the DMVs didn't do the test the first time and all types of crazy. And this morning I went with the intent to just to do like a regular state ID. And then I was there and my friend texted me. She was like, why don't you just do the permit? And I'm like, you know, while I was filling out the paper, I was thinking about it. I'm like, maybe I should just try to do the permit. And if I go and they're saying I don't have something, I'll just do the ID. And she's like, yeah, I think you should. Because you said you do the test online all the time and you pass it. So maybe you should. And I'm like, you know what? You're right. That's definitely what I'm going to do. I went, I did the test, and I passed. So I'm really happy about that. I'm going to hopefully start getting some practice. I'm gonna go to uh, like a driving school or something at some point to get some professional practice, but I'm gonna take as much <laughs> as I can get. And then who knows, I'm gonna get my license and then I'm gonna be driving everywhere. <laughs> I'm I'm just talking shit. But um yeah, that's what's up. I'm going to work. I checked my schedule again and realized that work is actually at 2:30 and not 2 o'clock. So that gives me a little bit more time. But um this is where I'm going to end this vlog cuz it's a little on the longer side. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys in my next video.